On one side, artists wanting to sell paintings on the sidewalk. On the other, Mayor Giuliani saying no. In the middle of the First Amendment of what it says about artistic freedom. Andrew Glassman tells us how the U.S. Supreme Court has ended this legal battle. Robert Letterman is known less for his artwork, more for the number of times his paintings have gotten him arrested. He's one of the hundreds of artists who set up on the sidewalk and make their living selling art on the street. This is home video of one of the 15 times he says he's been arrested by officers acting on orders from City Hall to clear artists and artwork from the street. Letterman says tens of thousands of paintings have been confiscated by the NYPD and either auctioned away or destroyed. It's horrible. It's very much uh, akin to what happened in Nazi Germany. And the city doesn't understand that this is not merchandise. These are, in most cases, one-of-a-kind original works of art. He sued and won an appeal court verdict, which said displaying, even selling art on the street, is a protected freedom of speech. The city, home to some of the most famous museums and paintings in the world, appealed to the Supreme Court by arguing an exhibition of paintings is not as communicative as speech, literature, or live entertainment, and the artist's constitutional interest is thus minimal. Today, the high court decided not to hear that argument, meaning the lower court ruling for the artists stands. These arrests have continued while the city waited to hear from the Supreme Court, but now that may have to change. The mayor's office admitted this was a big disappointment and said it will force them to come up with a policy that brings the city into compliance with the law. For Robert Letterman, a victory, one that appears to make street artists a legal, permanent part of the city's landscape. Andrew Glassman, News Channel 4. Community groups in Soho and business groups in Midtown have pressured City Hall to crack down on sidewalk artists claiming they crowd the sidewalks.